Hello guys and welcome back and we are finally back in our next episode of Let's Play Skyrim. It's been a few days I'm sure for, since you guys seen the last episode and guess what instead of going to Falkreath Not Falkreath. That's where I am. Instead of going mm -hmm. to Falskar I kind of went out of my way and I figured oh hello It's you again All right, um Anyway, I figured out the next mod how to start it. It was in my uh quest markers or whatever so no big deal we're gonna go ahead and get that get it started and before I even forget let's go look at it follow the instruction of the folded note so I don't really know which mod this is for it could be interesting NPCs it could be a whole bunch of stuff I don't I don't even know where I'm at anymore considering how many mods I have installed I do know worms tooth has not been activated yet well it kind of has been but you know all right let's just explore this place really quick so I have it on lockdown yo We'll also look at that shack. Actually, you know what? Do we want to look at this? Yeah, might as well. It's right here. Excuse me. What's on you? Oh, crap. Fight! Slaves. Alright, anyway. I'll let them work on that. Who are you? You have something to say. Well, save your breath. The way I see it, you don't have much more than left. Who are you? I just wanted to talk. Talk is for cowards whose plates say nothing. <laughs> so you wish to hear the song of my plates, then? I would. You better listen carefully. As you ever make it past the first verse. I wish to know your name. A son of Cloud Rula Temple named me the Desert Fang. The Thalmor know me as Descuria. To you, I am simply Zavashni, the Kashyyyk who spared your life. Stupid dog. Oh, uh, Cyrodiil, fool! Really? From the steps of Cloud Willa Temple. Whence I came before that, no one knows. The blade who had left the service found me as he descended the steps. To him, it was a sign. A blade? Divine. You mean Esbern? In truth, it was just a cowardly mother waiting for the opportune time and a man with forlorn eyes. Having left the order, his eyes were indeed tainted with sorrow, and for that he pitied this kitten when he should have abandoned it. Yet it was his newly discovered faith in the workings of the gods that inspired him to develop the skills for which I'm the caretaker. Hmm. The world has followed such tales of fate and coincidence. That's what we burn into our memories. And all the other instances. Every day we live without incident. Those moments are never ascribed to the laziness of the gods. Just dog needs to him. shut up. A dragon roosts in the hills to the south. Having just gained life, it's not eager for death, and therefore it's my steel. I'll go for it. Out uh, to the south, you say? Akaviri, forged in a dragon land. There's a sword and armor of the blades, sworn to the service of the true emperor, but know this. My sword serves no one. You could be Tiber Septon Reborn. And I'll still send you back to the Divines with your head in your arms. I can take you. Do you know Delphine? And do you by chance know Abasi, Tizakar, or Adanja? Or should I throw okay, fine. names into I just, the I, just, I was just curious. How daft you are. I don't know this Delphine. Dog. I don't know why you would bring up a name 
other than to convince me you are a fool. All right, time to die. You need not convince me of such. But this Delphine, if she is half the fool you are, won't appreciate how carelessly you toss around her name. All right. What you consider a fight, or even a war, is nothing more than a brawl between drunken louts over a spilled drink. Can I please kill you? A great swordsman's talents are wasted in a war. Stray arrows, trebuchets, accidents. Many great warriors have been felt by the blade of chaos. One can't even trust his own side in the haze of war. Who's to say who's friend or foe when your eyes squint through geysers of dirt and smoke? Like your queries, they range from the utterly pointless to the completely meaningless. <laughs> so the imbecile can count two, <laughs> one more than I expected. But it doesn't count if you use your hands. Again, your narrow mind fails you. One can loathe more than one thing, and more than one people. If I were an archer standing before a Nord and a Thalmor, and had but two arrows in my quiver, you might ask me who I'd shoot first. And I'd tell you. I'd shoot the Thalmor twice. <laughs> their presence is thinner here, and their embassy on the other side of the province. From this perch, I can track and kill their justicars by the threes, as the Thalmor are too much of cowards to face me alone. Alright. Be gone, then. Alright, I'm gonna try something. What do you have on you? Nothing! Speak. You suck. Anyway, that was a weird conversation. I thought I was gonna be able to fight her. Nope. Oh, God dang it. Yes. It's me. Calm down. Go through this like every day. <sighs> Whoop do you freaking do? How is this thing already dead? Whatever. I'll let them fight. Oh my god. There's death everywhere. What? Kind of crap. Forgot that was even selected. Come on. This happens all the time. Thank you. Oh, do you really want to fight, man? Shot. What? <laughs> um. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I was curious. What happens if I shoot you? Um. Don't be a marked essential. You're not. And you're dead. Huh. Alright, I was just curious. There's a shack up here. Let's go check out the shack. Kinda, kinda wish that uh, we'd get a revamped... Uh, I'm sure there's a mod for that. A revamped uh, sound when it comes to combat music. Because it's always the same thing. The rest of the music in this game is fine. Not bad. I get tired of hearing it. I think I know where this is. How do I get up there, though? I believe it's through this little stream, sir. Let me up here. Thank you. Just some old house. Greenwood Shack. What you got? Yes, somewhat decent. Now, yeah, might as well sleep. The 
interest in bonus. Stupid dog. I'm sorry. Just, just, I don't. Okay, bye. I want to meet you. I just don't meet you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, doggy. You're just annoying. Lydia calls you stupid. You can't have the wife being mad. If she's mad, then it's just not good. It's a relationship. Because then, oh god. It's not good as being a human. Just why is it up on the second floor? What is even up here? Dang. Wheat hall, <laughs> wheat hall, wheat hall wall, y'all hacks, yo. I crack myself up. Dogs be barking. Uh. Do I have candlelight? No. It's a chest. I got. Oh, you know what's creepy? I have the windows open. Open door. Um. No, I don't want to read that. I want the lock. Oh, whatever. What you got in here? Some gold. I don't like it in here. This is kind of scary. So you sent me the letter. We do. Oh God. You are right on trial. I sent you the letter physically, but it is my goddess that spoke the words, and she is in need of you, Mortal. No need to raise one's voice over petty words, but you are right in some sense. Time is short. My goddess, Meridia, needs you to save some of her followers and purify a great evil in the process. You will of course be properly rewarded. Everything will be explained in due time, but it is best if you know as little as possible when you are still here in Skyrim. Are you accepting those terms? Uh, sure. Then hear me out. You are to travel to the island known as Utenhead. But it is a long voyage. You will need a ship and a crew. Okay. Since the authorities do not enjoy the existence of the island, you cannot just ask anybody to take you there. I suggest you speak to Helgi. <laughs> she is a smuggler and has been chosen by us without your knowledge. You are to meet her in the Winking Skeever in solitude and present her this. All right. You do not need to know what it is, only that it will convince her. Tell her that there is much more where that came from once you reach Utenheim. Is it gold? The time is short, and you need to hurry. Strange amulet. Oh, it is God. God dang. Woman. I don't like this. Okay, I remember this quest now. I have no clue what it's about, but I know it's a whole, like, island quest line. Which is unfortunate, I guess, because I wanted it to stay in Skyrim. But no big deal. Alright, so we have to go up to Solitude, they said. Go to Solitude, they said. It'll be fun, they said. It'll be far away, it is. Oh my god, that's far away. Alright, we're just gonna fast travel there. It's just too far away for, for us to do any kind of other other things with stuff involved. Sorry if you hear a chair squeaking. It's just the chair. I, I mean... <sighs> Let's see. I don't know, I was just thinking. Alright, so, DirectX 12. Oh god, hello. Look at this beautifulness. Oh, you guys mad at me still? My cousin's out fighting dragons, and what do I get? Guard duty. Who are you? Yes, what do you want? Can't you see I'm busy dying? You're okay. <laughs> what do you mean you could see that? You could see me aging? I'm sorry. I don't want to care, woman. <laughs> that was probably really offensive. I'm sorry if it offended you. But it's kind of funny. Alrighty then, so we have to go in here and be like, ho. Oh. Alright, ho. Oh. Who are you? Feel free to make requests. Sure. 
What can I do for you? Dragonborn comes. Yeah. Yes. Still here. Oh. Oh yeah, woman, dance with me. No, no, dance. Our hero, our hero, paint a warrior's heart. Mm. I tell you, yes. I tell you the dragonborn comes. Perfect. Perfect song. <laughs> Why you stop dancing? Believe, believe the dragonborn comes. <laughs> to the evil of all Skyrim's foes. Beware, beware <laughs> the dragonborn comes. Oh, Lydia. You're For freaking great. True. I may look by blade or by spell. But if I you want it dead, wit I'll make it dead. Hello All you need to do is We haven't is met, have we? I I'm Fironet, although my friends spell. call me Firo, or Please Meta tell me I can somehow marry you. Uh, although I guess I'm getting ahead of myself. We just met, so we're hardly friends. N not to mean that we won't be friends someday. O or even today. I I'm sorry, I'm really bad at this. It's okay. It's kind of weird. <laughs> uh Oh, um um well met as well. I mean well met and greetings. Ah, well, what I'm trying to say is greetings and well met. I like how she's dancing. Oh, she's all live. Treats. I did it again, didn't I? Well, I was kind of hoping I could. I know you're probably thinking I've gone mad the way I fumbled through our meeting. And truth is, I'm perfectly happy just being net of the milkmaid. Well, my friends have all said that I have a great singing voice. I suppose they should, because that's what friends do. But after hearing it a number of times from different people, you start to think there's something to it. So, here I am. You mean like sing? Right here. Um, well, okay, but um, my voice is a little hoarse from <laughs> practicing. Is there anything in particular you want to hear? Please tell me Dragonborn comes there. If it's not, uh, oh. That's about the old legend, isn't it? I'll do my best, but to be honest, I'm not sure of all the lines. A hero, a hero has a warrior soul. True, I, I may look the part of dashing soul. What do you look like? But I prefer the old need cow. something. There's been rumors of Talos worshippers leaving notes at the temple of the school. Anyway, I've never seen one myself though. All right, ho. Oh. What? Go to the temple, divine solitude, and investigate the Talos shrine. What? Oh, okay. About to say. Is there anything you need? What's in here? I'm right behind you. Woman, if you don't move. So nothing. Who are you? The Empire is on edge. All these dragon attacks can't be good for business. What's that? Dang. Oh. What am I doing in here? That lady. I love how Minette pretends to know. Let's wait. Things she doesn't, but not the things she does. Alright, uh. Is there anything you need? Seems there's always more to be done. I'm getting on the first boat out. I don't know about you, but I've got to get as far away from Skyrim as possible. Why? It was a cabin somewhere on the north bank of a white, near Riverwood. A kind old lady was living there. Or so I thought. She let me stay the night, but told me not to go into the cellar. But naturally, I got curious. There was all sorts of oddities in there. I think she was a witch or a necromancer or something. In any case, I got out of that cellar and never stopped running. Dude, that's everywhere. Oh, fantastic. I know. I considered going to a face sculptor, but she refused to work with me. You can try her if you want. She lives in some hole in the ground over in Markarth. 
Sweet! Stuff to do! See, I will select them. Now, I'm pretty sure it's being stupid because it wants me to wait. And it's the middle of the night. Alright. Is there anything you need? There's nothing like a good song to lift the spirit of the troubled times. Uh, oh, hello. Um, now you. Welcome to the Winking Skeever, friend. That's what it's called. Um, any rumors? Here, take a look at this. Bird's eye added? What's a bird eye? Bird, 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 bird. What? Maybe be under, like, miscellaneous, you think? I don't know. Oh my god, shut up! Who are you? Yes. Ooh. Need something? Yes. Need you. What do you need? Need you to get up and speak to me! Hmm? You know, I know that the Daedric armor is like the best you can get, but it looks so bad on me. It makes my hips look like a moose. Yes? Oh, what do you want? Need something? Yes? Oh my god, you are so hard to predict. Alright. Let's close the door. Wait another three hours. I didn't say when to meet her here, but I'm assuming it's because it's late at night. And it's now middle of the day, every shop is open. Hello. Dang it, woman. I got all happy for a second. How much gold in there? 33. Good enough. Alright. Um, what's in here? A bunch of crap. Oh, pfft, I'm an idiot. <laughs> what do you want? What the freaking speak to you? I didn't know you were upstairs. Who do you take me for? I'm just a traitor pressing through and won't be staying for long. I don't care. Neat piece of jewelry you got there. Listen, I don't have time for this. My ship is leaving very soon. What's going on? Is this business or what? Yeah. You better start making sense right now. I'm not into that kind of business, and I really need to get going. I'm sorry, but this mic is terrible. Fine. You know what? Meet me near the lighthouse northeast of Solitude and we'll talk. Come alone. I'm bringing my woman. Alright, where am I going to meet you? Not that. Alright. Alright, we'll do that uh, one day. I've got your back. Alright, freaking woman, if you don't. Shut up. Alright, what's over here? Oh, it's outside. All right. Uh, is there anything else we can do before the new super show? Okay. Now we have to go to a Markarth and Riverwood, somewhere down there. Those two places need to get explored. All right. Well, I thank you guys for watching this episode. If you want to see anything else, like subscribe to the channel. See you guys. Thank you.